El movimiento Black Lives Matter ha ganado mucha fuerza en los Estados Unidos. No obstante, para políticos de la extrema derecha como Ben Shapiro, quien bien podría ser el próximo presidente de los Estados Unidos, este movimiento no tiene ningún sentido. How can you argue that racism is not a driving factor in income inequality? Because it has nothing to do with race and everything to do with culture. And when you have a culture that doesn't And when and when it... You know what? Explain to me. You explain to me why black kids aren't graduating high school. Explain that one to me. Explain to me why black kids are shooting each other in rates significantly higher than whites are shooting each other. Explain to me why 13% of the population is responsible for 50% of the murder. Explain to me why the, why the number of blacks and black kids in prison, not for innocent reasons, not for walking down the street and getting pulled into a prison, is so high. Explain, if it has nothing to do with culture, explain to me why the single motherhood rate in the black community jumped from 20% to 70% in the same course of time that the civil rights movement has made such tremendous strides. Is America more racist now than it was in 1960? And if it is, please explain to me how that happened. Aclaro que esta es simplemente la opinión de Ben Shapiro y no la mía. Ahora, ¿qué opinan ustedes al respecto?